Hey everyone, welcome to Wake Up and Get Real with Kelly Catrone and Justine Bateman. Um, I just woke up, so I'm pulling a Kelly Catrone with the sunglasses. <clears throat> well, I want to say Happy Mother's Day to all those people who have kids. And, but I want to talk about, you know, before I had kids, um, there were certain women that tried to make me feel like, uh, because I didn't have kids yet, you know, I, I haven't really known love, um... Uh, it wasn't really a woman, you know, I hadn't gone into this, like, this n next dimension of understanding of things like they had and all this. And uh, I just want to tell you now, you know, having had kids, that that whole idea that, you know, I'm more of a woman now, or I have a better understanding about love now, or I understand another dimension of life now, it's total fucking bullshit. So any of our friends out there who are having a hard time having kids or don't really want kids and are, like, you know, torn about that decision or, um, or just have, you know, just were never able to have kids. And if any of you are feeling any of that, those, those feelings that I just mentioned, like, oh, what if, you know, do I really know love or am I a complete woman and all of this, I was just telling you, like, forget it because it's not, it's not true. I don't have a better understanding about some special dimension of life. I don't, uh, I love, I mean, I knew love before I had them and I know love now and yeah, they're great. But, you know, is it like, oh, I've never known love, uh, you know, but, I didn't realize that, you know, I didn't know love until I met my kids. I mean, it's fucking bullshit. So <clears throat> rest assured you're not missing anything. And you are a total and complete woman. And I'm not more of a woman now because I, because I push these two things out. I'm just not. I had that experience, okay, but I'm not more of a woman. That's ridiculous. And anybody who tries to make you feel that way are... They're, they're just telling you how terribly insecure they are about how cool you are. Because this is them saying things like that or trying to make you feel like that is their effort to feel a little bit better than you. And you know how you can really tell? Because the minute, if, if you do happen to get pregnant, uh, then they'll, be, they'll feel really threatened because then now you've got one over in their minds. Because in their minds they were thinking like, well, she's got this and she's got that, but uh, at least I have got a kid. And then when you level that playing field, then they're like, ah. Oh. <laughs> anyway, you don't have to have kids to feel like a real woman. It's ridiculous. And you know love now. You don't need that experience to know that. And there is no other dimension of understanding. Happy Mother's Day to you all.